All right, what's up you guys? So I just got a comment on my video asking me what are my thoughts on pre-workouts. Now I think I've done a video on this in the past, but I'm going to go ahead and do one again. Uh, I'm filming this on my iPhone, obviously not my webcam, so I apologize for the video quality if it's a little bit shitty. Um, but let's get right into it. So basically, I started taking uh, pre-workout supplements my junior year in high school. Now at the end of my senior year in high school, I had a pretty interesting experience, which I believe was a direct result of uh, taking pre-workout supplements. Now, on the pre-workout supplement bottle, it tells you, you know, take take this for no more than four weeks, eight weeks, and then take two months off. Well, I took these supplements year-round for about two years. Never took a break. At the end of my senior year, uh, I was sitting in class and I had this really bad pain in my lower back. Then I had this really bad pain like in my groin. So uh, I went to pee because I thought I had to piss or something, and I was pissing out blood. And I was like, oh shit, I need to go to the hospital or the doctor. So I went to the doctor. The doctor says, uh, I peed in a cup, they tested my urine, they said, you know, there's a lot of blood in your urine. Uh, we think you either had a kidney stone or there's something really wrong with your kidneys. Now, uh, this is super, super unnatural for somebody your age. I was only 17 when I was a senior. They were like, this is really... This is really not normal. So something something abnormal caused this. Either they said uh, if it wasn't genetic, then it was just something really weird. If there was if there was no history of kidney stones in my family, then this was just weird. And there's no history of kidney stones in my family. So you know, I didn't tell them about the pre workout, but I'm assuming you know that's what it was because I've never had any health issues until I started taking these pre workouts. So like a dumbass, I kept taking pre workout even after this kidney issue. And I, my heart, uh, I could tell my blood pressure was going up. I would get heart, I would get heart pains when I would work out really hard or intense. I would get really bad headaches. Um, my dick would shrivel up after I would take pre workout. When I was done with a workout, I just had a super just crash. Like I had no energy when I was fucking done with a workout. And uh, so I tried to get off pre workout several times when I started college. And when you when you get off pre workout, you know it's not easy. You can't just you can't just quit. You don't want to go to the gym. You just have no energy. And that's that lasts for like the first three weeks of quitting pre-workout. I've been off pre-workout for almost a year now. And I feel fucking fantastic. Back in the gym, I'm training just as hard, if not harder, than I did when I was on pre-workout. I just don't train as long. Uh, training as long isn't really necessary. I mean, you don't need fucking three hours of training. You need an hour and a half, you're good. Um, so I'm back to normal. Like it can be done. You can quit pre-workout if you have the if you just have the you just have the balls and the dedication to do it. That's what I did. I just fucking quit. Um, I was miserable for about a fucking month, but my body feels great. My headaches went away. I no longer have chest pain or heart pain when I'm working out. My kidneys feel fine. I've been drinking a ton of water, just trying to get them back to functioning normally. Um, and my body just feels so much better when I'm when, at, now that I'm done taking pre-workout. I just think these companies don't really tell us what's in these pre-workouts and there's just so many chemicals and stimulants and just so much bullshit you're pouring into your body. It's just not good for you. This shit's not regulated. Nobody's keeping track of what's going into this shit. They can put whatever they want in this stuff. Whether it hurts you or not, it, it, they, they can put whatever they want. It's not regulated. So um, my advice is don't take pre-workout. It's bad. You'll get addicted to it. You're just pouring chemicals in your body. And me personally, I'd rather not piss blood um, just so I could take a little bit of pre-workout. I do drink a little bit of coffee before I go to the gym to get a little bit of an energy kick. Um, but I don't drink a lot, barely half a cup, just a little tiny bit of caffeine will get me going. Um, but yeah, the pre-workouts I took when I had those kidney problems were Jack 3D and NO Explode. And you know, I was taking the three scoops maximum of Jack. I was taking all the maximum dosages. So if you guys are going to take pre-workout, take the lowest possible dose. Those maximum dosages had me amped the fuck up, but I feel like that's what caused my kidney problems, guys. So those are my thoughts on pre-workouts. Just don't fucking buy them. They're, it's a bad thing to get into. If you need motivation to go to the gym, go watch a training video of a pro bodybuilder. That'll get your ass in the gym.